lady guys what is up welcome back to a week in my leg video we're starting off a little bit late it is monday june 21st it's like 5 30 right now and i've been up for quite some time and just like running around getting everything done evan and i are actually going on our annual anniversary trip to Cape Cod. We are celebrating eight years this year and so this is our tradition. It was kind of like a last minute decision to go. We like weren't really planning it because we've been like super busy and everything but we were like let's just go for a few days because why not. So we are packed up. Billy's in the back here um, and we're ready to go. Ignore this pimple patch on my face. I was thinking that putting makeup over it was going to make it not show up but I was wrong. So we have to stop at my parents' house really quick to get my key for the cape and uh, then we will be off. So we're getting a little bit of a later start than we had planned, but we are on our way. We're still okay on time and we're ready to get this little vacay started. I look like a rag doll. I need help. Okay, well. I haven't vlogged much. We've been here for a couple hours now and wait, listen to this. Volume zero. That's the most annoying thing I've ever heard in my entire life. I'm sure you can turn it off. Yeah, I think you can, but that's annoying. Okay, so looking disheveled. We got here at a little after eight. For those of you that don't know, I don't know why you would know. My brothers work up at the Cape during the summer. They live up here and work here. And we were like 10 minutes away from the Cape house. I got a call and my brother broke down trying to leave the Cape. So I was thinking I was gonna need to go help him. Evan had class starting in an hour, still had work to do for it. And The Bachelor was also starting at eight. So there was just a lot going on. I was a little overwhelmed. But we got here, everything was also closing. So I had to watch, well like play the bouch on my phone while I ran out and grabbed some dinner. Came back here, finished watching and ate, and then I ended up running out to stop and shop because Billy was just like not being himself. Like he, we had to put him in his tiny little cage to travel. And I hate putting him in there. And his house is so much bigger now, so it takes up so much of it. So he has like no space to move. And I felt so sad. But so I went and I got him some spinach before they closed. And he's doing better now. Now it's time for bed. I'm so tired. I like, my whole body just hurts. My ankle hurts, my shoulder hurts, my back hurts. I just, I need to have someone crack my entire body and then massage me. Not a very eventful day, but tomorrow, I don't know what we're gonna do tomorrow. We'll have to figure it out. I'll take you guys along through it. Another quick update before we head to bed. I didn't mention it in this vlog, but I mentioned it. Actually, I don't think I'm gonna end up posting that weekend vlog because I didn't end up vlogging much, but we were supposed to be getting a dog, a puppy, this upcoming weekend. So that was supposed to be part of this vlog and it got pushed back to July 10th. So we're really bummed about that, but um, something exciting to look forward to. I'm not gonna like show you guys or tell you much yet. I want it to kind of be a little surprise cause I can never keep surprises. So I just feel like it'll be fun. So I was gonna tell you it all, but I, I'm just too excited. So I'm gonna get ready for bed and we'll see you guys in the morning. Hello and happy Tuesday. It's a bit late in the day at this point. We got up, we were kind of running around this morning. We have some honeydew. I have a package to ship out that I had to like wrap up. So we just did that. I ran across the street um, cause I needed some like packing stuff. And now we're gonna head out. Don't really know what we're doing today, but I think it's actually gonna start raining pretty soon. So probably an indoor activity. I'm kind of sad because it was like really nice this morning and we didn't really get to enjoy it that much, but tomorrow's a new day and it's gonna be nice tomorrow. So we'll take advantage of all of it. So I'm gonna take you guys along, ship out the packages, figure out what we're doing. Let's start the day. Hello, we're back home now. We got some dinner to go from Clancy's if you've been to the cave. I'm I feel like there's a lot in here. Oh, there's a roll. A roll? Yeah. 
Is it? Oh, it must be gluten free. You think? Well, it looks gluten free. <laughs> it does look kind of gluten free. That's 100% gluten free. They would not give you that if it wasn't. Definitely gluten free. I'm fine with it though. Except it's probably not yeast free. Mm. Dang. Keep trying. The thought was there. Gluten free clam chowder. I tried this last year. Amazing. I'm pumped for this. Gluten free shrimp scampi. My favorite thing, like literally ever. Wow. Bone apple teeth. Let's dig the heck in. We ate dinner. <laughs> I don't know if it was the uh, dairy aspect of the clam chowder or a gluten problem, but I feel as though something was not right and uh, I do not feel my best. I also have a pretty bad migraine. I actually just laid down for a little bit and I feel a little better. Forgot to do a little Target haul. We ran into Target. And I figured I'd show you what we got. Okay, just ran outside, it's raining. I look disheveled because I just like, I don't even know if I took a nap or if I just laid down. I don't even know, I'm confused. So Evan got this like pre-made margarita thing. Flybird, Baja Lime Margarita. The packaging is just beautiful. I got this to bring to the beach. Um, which is really cool. You just freeze it and then like you can rip this top off and drink it. So strawberry daiquiri. I've also been wanting a different soap dispenser for our kitchen counter because the one that I got, I love it. It's really cute, but it gets so like stained from the soap um, because it's like made of like a marble granite like I don't know some type of stone and I like cannot clean it like it's like stained permanently looks the way it does and it drives me nuts everything else looks so clean and then that looks like a disaster so this like matches the um, like backsplash really well so we're gonna get that I know I have gold but our appliances and stuff are stainless steel so I feel like this will go well and it'll be easy to just clean. Got the eyebrow pencil because mine ran out. And then I'm gonna try this on. So we'll give you a little try on portion. I wasn't planning on shopping for clothes, but I saw this and it's so soft and like cozy looking. It's like this little like jumpsuit, like sweatsuit jumpsuit. I'm gonna try it on. I feel like there's a good chance I'm gonna hate it because of the length of it. It's like a little short and for me, like, I need things shorter, but if they're like a certain length, it just looks like weird on me. So I kind of have a feeling it's gonna be like that, but we're gonna try it on. It was like 15 bucks in cozy, and so let's try it. Okay, this is kind of a bit of a fail. It's really cozy. It's just like super low cut. So like my sticky bra is just hanging out all over the place. And then you like can kind of see, it's like a weird-ish length. I don't know, it could still be cute. I feel like with like some chunky like jewelry, like some chunky gold jewelry. Um, for like traveling or, I don't know. It, it's, I, I kind of see why it was on clearance, but it's not bad. It's cozy, we'll see. <laughs> okay, let's see. Just weird. I'm thinking it's a no. Hello! It's Wednesday, June 23rd. You know what that means? Eight years! Woo! I've been the worst about vlogging. Um, so it's a little late. I just got ready. We like took the morning slow, you know? We snuggle, we love to snuggle, so why not? Just, you know, why force ourselves to get out of bed when we don't really want it, you know? So, we were supposed to go to the beach. We didn't go to the beach. We're gonna go to the beach tomorrow, it's hopefully. Cool yeah, it wasn't a good beach day, for sure, so. We need to go tomorrow, even if it's for like an hour, yeah. Yeah, yeah, tomorrow's gonna be nicer in the morning, so. I just got ready, got a little matching set on, little pink bag, match the nails, you know? 
I gotta finish putting my jewelry on. I just wanted to check to make sure that my camera was charged. Don't know why it wouldn't be, because I haven't been vlogging. Let's see, are we feeling a gold moment or a silver moment? Are we feeling a gold or a silver moment? Gold. Gold? Always gold. Always gold, okay, always gold. Always gold. Let's get the gold. Okay, we're ready to go to dinner. We put the jewelry on, we're doing a gold moment. We're marching. You know, you know the vibes, you know the vibes. Let's go, we're going to our favorite restaurant at Cape Well, my favorite restaurant. It's a tradition, we go for our anniversary every year. It's called Brax Landing and it's just, it's just my fave place on the Cape. Beautiful views, great food. Couldn't ask for more. Let's go. Say happy anniversary. <laughs> Okay guys, we got out of dinner. It was so good. Get mm. the steamers, the Brax special. I haven't got a chicken sandwich. Everything was fire. The Godzilla drink is also wonderful, except now I have heartburn from it, so don't love that. But we just drove over to Chatham, which was like, I don't know, like 15 minutes away? 12 minutes. 12 minutes. And there's a little video, if you guys follow my 410 Instagram, that I like posted a little video of when I like stuck a- Was that last year or the year before? Last year. Um, I stuck a 410 sticker to like this pole. Where's my hat? Wow. Should this not be in a vlog? No, it definitely shouldn't be, but it's okay. We can still have the footage. It's in Chatham and we just came here. I wanna see if it's still there, which I'm sure it is. It's actually probably destroyed because it was like a really like trash sticker like when I first like started. We're gonna see if it's there. What do we sound? It's not. We'll find out. Oh my god, there's a bunny. That's so tiny. Oh my god. That's a baby god. bunny. Wait a second. A we can't even see it on the camera. It's a baby. Oh, it's so Hi, cute. Little baby. Butter. Peanut butter on a spoon. <laughs> Where's that from? Me. Oh, we just used to that. <laughs> if you go to Cape Cod Creamery and you like super sweet, like birthday cakey flavors and stuff, get the cake batter with sprinkles. There's like sprinkles in the ice cream. It's the greatest thing to literally ever exist, ever. So. Good morning. Happy Thursday. We're getting a late start to the day again. Um, the whole beach plan, yeah. it didn't happen. It's really hot out. No. Well, it's kind of warm right now, but like if we went this morning, it like wouldn't have been. It's so whatever. I feel like we just go to the beach because like we're at the Cape, we're supposed to go to the beach. Not even because like we like really, really want to, if that makes sense. Plus I forgot my book, which I wanted to bring. Yeah, I didn't bring it. Books. I had headphones, but yeah, I didn't have anything, so we really were not prepared for the beach. Right now, we're gonna head over to our daily honeydew. They have a gluten-free donut. It's wonderful. And the rice cup is pretty good. I got my. It's not Dunkin', but it's different. You Coke. Know? I'm vibing with it. Okay. We're gonna head over there, and we're probably gonna leave today. Not like super late, but like a little bit later. So we'll see. This. This tan difference, my neck and face is really bad. The 
Yum. Oh, Sprinkle Donut. Yum, yum. I'm the worst vlogger ever. Why is this lighting so dark? Like it's light here, but it's dark here. Make it make sense. All my makeup. It off of my face. Better. It's a little light now. I don't remember if I showed you guys, but we went to Cream and Cone. They have two locations. One in, I think, West Dennis and West Chatham. And we went to the one in Chatham because they have a gluten-free menu, which is phenom because the only thing I can get at the dentist one is a lobster roll, which is not a problem. Trust me, not a problem. It's just that uh, it's expensive as heck, so yeah. It is a little bit of a problem. We went, grabbed that, been back for a while. We played Uno for a little bit. We're just like kind of like tired. I think we're really tired because I don't know if this is an actual thing, but I feel like this is how I feel every time. We are so used to taking melatonin every night that when I don't take it, like we forgot to bring it with us, I'm so like drowsy and like lazy and tired the next day. So we've just been tired the whole trip. We're washing the sheets and towels and stuff that we used. And I'm gonna just pack up while we're waiting for those to dry so then we can get out of here. It's already like seven. So I kind of wanted to leave a little bit earlier than this, but we're still like on good time, kind of. So I'm just gonna pack everything up. And so we're ready when everything's dry. Hello. <laughs> We're home now. It's almost 1 a.m. I just ripped all of my makeup off and put an ice mask on my head as fast as I possibly could. If you have migraines, you know, driving at night is the absolute worst because everyone's headlights just blind you. So that was not fun, but we're home now. I'm gonna head to bed. I'm so exhausted. I will talk to you in the morning. Good night. Good morning. Today is Saturday, June. 26th. 26th and it is a fab day because we are headed to Fenway Park for a Red Sox versus Yankees game and we're gonna get to see the Red Sox win again I can see Yankees and we're just so pumped for it so it's like about almost two o'clock now been up getting ready we're gonna head out Evan and I are going with my parents and I'm so excited and we're just gonna have a fun little day and I'm gonna take you guys along. Um, we're just gonna kinda like walk around the city for a little bit before, grab some food, you know. Very excited. Let's get into the day.